On the dairy report, the USDA is out with a new dairy export numbers. Overall, it expects total exports to grow by $1 billion in 2017, with dairy exports taking a big chunk of that growth. The latest export projections showing dairy growing by $500 million to $5.3 billion in the year 2017. USDA does expect dairy imports to America will also rise up $200 million in the coming year. One of the big export targets is China. According to our partners at Farm Journal's Milk Magazine, Chinese import volume of dairy products grew 18% on a milk equivalent basis through the first eight months of 2016. Now breaking it down, cheese, fluid milk, cream, and infant formula are all on pace for a record year, even beating the high water mark set back in 2014. Now in the first eight months of 2016, Chinese fluid milk and cream imports grew 63% compared to last year, Cheese and infant formula is up more than 30%. And speaking of outlooks, analysts expect 2017 hay prices to remain steady. They say strong supplies and a little softer demand is likely to keep pressure on the industry, except for premium alfalfa, that's expected to remain on the high side. With more than 56 million acres harvested this year, strong supplies and above average carryover is expected through the winter. The Northeast and Southeast are two regions where farmers are feeding up bales due to drought. New statistics show more students are choosing to eat breakfast at school. Up next, we'll find one reason why kids are making healthier choices in the cafeteria line. Enter for your chance to win two registrations to the Top Producer Seminar, January 24th through the 27th in Chicago. Package includes a three-night hotel stay plus a $200 Visa gift card. Go to topproducerseminar.com sweepstakes.